Hi there, uh, Darth Geekula here with a uh, quick Darth Hall video, and uh, this is just going to be a random, wacky, nutty, crazy kind of haul. It just so happened through a strange confluence of factors, I got a bunch of stuff today. Didn't even pay for it all, which is the best part. Uh, so let's just get started on this crazy, random, well, not totally random. Most of it's most of it's Star Wars. Uh, but let's get started, and I'll show you the wacky stuff that I got. Okay. Uh, I did a video on this guy before. It's the uh, Star Wars Black Series, The Force Awakens, Resistance Trooper. I got two more of them. Uh, I have a friend, an inside source, if you will, that works at Toys R Us. Um, so he picked these up for me and uh, used his uh, used his discount Shh. and uh, got these. So now I have four Resistance Troopers. My wife does not understand that. Um, and also, he gave me this. This gave it to me. What a great guy. It's the uh, Force Awakens Polybag Lego c 3 I actually have one. Uh, that's opened and put together. It wasn't hard to put together, but uh, it's kind of cool. I'll probably just keep this one. I'm usually an opener, um, but because I have two of them, I'll probably just keep this one in the poly bag. And he also picked up for me at absolutely no charge whatsoever these weird uh, promotional medals that Toys R Us did. So this is... Uh, Oh, that's Endor. Got Wicked on the front. This one is Yavin. The Battle of Yavin. Uh, this is Hoth. And Tatooine. So, yeah, it was. I, I don't even understand how you were supposed to get these from Toys R Us. I know there was some kind of game or something. Uh, but my buddy was nice enough to uh, just swipe these and give them to me. So, they're actually... They're kind of neat, and I didn't want to get them. Didn't know how to get them. Uh, it turns out you just know someone that works at Toys R Us, and he will grab you up. Okay, now it's time to play Crazy Random Mystery Package. Let's see what I got. Ooh, bubble wrap. Let's open this. Okay, bubble wrap is unbubble wrapped. We have a vintage Chewbacca. I already have a Chewbacca, but he's going to go in the Millennium Falcon. I have the ADAT or ATAT -AT Commander. And everyone's favorite bounty hunter with a toothache, Dengar. And, and I got, if I cannot lose it, a Smuggler's Blaster, or Han Blaster, or Rebel Blaster. So that's very cool. I actually got all these uh, on a, a Facebook group called The Beater Cantina, which is an excellent place with a lot of cool people uh, selling and trading Star Wars stuff and not uh, at very reasonable prices. So that is cool that I got. That. Okay, and finally, I got this from a, a record store that also sells some... Uh, some collectibles and stuff. It was a loose uh, horse from uh, Toy Biz Lord of the Rings. It actually came with a figure, uh, one of the ring wraiths, even though I'm pretty sure this is not a ring wraith's horse. I think it's uh, Strider's horse. Irregardless, I have been wanting to get um, a 112 scale horsey, uh, specifically the, toy, the uh, Lord of the Rings ones, because I think they look really great. Not for a Lord of the Rings figure, but for my, uh, I already have them in a horsey riding stance, uh, <laughs> the uh, Mattel Dark Knight Returns Batman figure so that I could do this. There's a very famous scene in, uh, in the Dark Knight Returns, uh, one of my favorite comic stories of all time, where there's a, a nuclear explosion, power goes out all over, I think America, definitely Gotham City. Um, so Batman rides a horse. And it is really cool. So, I don't know. I mean, I might give the horse to Jonah Hex. Um, but regardless, I'm going to use this horse for something. And I think it will be for Batman. I need to play with it a little bit. 
make them look a little better on the horse. But uh, yeah, I found this for really cheap. I even got a, an extra figure with it that I don't even really want, but I'll use for something. So there you go. My crazy, wacky, out of control, totally insane, what an exciting life I live, crazy, wacky haul for the day. Okay, guys, that's it. And uh, I will uh, talk to you later. See ya.